Hello, welcome to lesson nine. This is a, uh, I call this a fun lesson. Lots of interesting topics and videos to watch. Some of the videos are a tad bit lengthy, uh, but they're well worth the, um, the investment. This lesson talks about education. That's the primary discussion. Then healthcare. We, um, this is actually a chapter or a lesson that should be divided up into um, two separate ones. But due to um, the amount of time that we have in the class, we can't necessarily always do that. So th this semester, uh, I've decided to uh, keep both topics inside the same lesson. But um, it really doesn't do justice for, for any topic. And later on into the um, if we have an extra lesson or two left at the very end of the semester, I may revisit these topics actually. Um, again, at least the education topic. There's, um, of course, your traditional lesson objectives and slides I've included. Also included two videos from, from Ken Robertson, who is a um, outspoken and, and well-respected critic of the education system not only in the United States, but, but globally. And um, he has a big um, and, and strong belief that that school should include um, creativity and encouraging students to uh, find creative measures uh, as part of their educational experience. And, and he's not the, the only person. He, he says that education is too standardized, that we're measuring all the wrong stuff, and uh, efforts such as No Child Left Behind is, is greatly missing the mark, which uh, I definitely agree with as an educator and um, uh, a parent. Uh, this lesson also includes, uh, um, again, healthcare information. Not as much as I would prefer, but it's enough to kind of whet our appetites. And your um, traditional chapter test as well as class manners readings, which is a really interesting reading that goes along with some of the Robertson, Ken Robertson videos about uh, from the Bronx to Cornell, how to transition from one educational standard and setting to another, and if you can truly do that. Plus, I've included a perception or a small chapter on public schools and what teachers do and what makes an effective teacher. Um, we'd really like to hear from you uh, about that in the discussion boards as well, in terms of, in your opinion, what makes an effective teacher. Again, as always, I'm here to help. If there's something I can do to, to, to correct an issue or to make things easier, please let me know. And we're getting really deep into the semester and getting closer to the end than the beginning. And that's always an exciting time. Take care.